Hi, my name is Nicolas Chillon and welcome to our next video on building the right DevSecOps stack. By the end of 2016, Garner predicted that 25% of top global 2000 organizations will have adopted DevOps as a mainstream strategy. Organizations that incorporate DevOps simply get more done. DevOps eliminates silos and promotes teamwork and collaboration. DevOps teams can deliver at a faster pace, innovate and bring new features to life, all while solving problems, increasing employee productivity, communication, engagement, and making environments more stable and secure. But because security and compliance remains a top priority, DevOps is just not enough. Its next generation integrates security and compliance into the DevOps lifecycle, creating DevSecOps. Unfortunately, implementing DevSecOps isn't simple. It requires a large technology stack with several solutions that need to be carefully integrated to successfully deploy the DevSecOps culture without creating gaps in security or creating bottlenecks. So one of the most important tools of your DevSecOps stack is your continuous integration and continuous delivery CICD solution. It orchestrates all of the moving pulse and ensure that everything is properly integrated and automated to make the magic happen. There are multiple CI/CD solutions such as Jenkins, Azure DevOps, Bamboo, Travis CI, Codeship and more. Now that you have a CI/CD tool, the first component of your DevSecOps stack is a plan and develop capability. This capability allows for the creation of user stories, planning sprints, and of course, to code. Plan and develop capability solutions include Jira and Rally. You will also need a version control system such as Git or Subversion and a source code repository such as GitHub. Next comes build capability, which takes your code and like the name suggests, builds it. Build solutions include Ant, Bamboo, CMake, Gradle, Maven, MS Build and more. Now you need to securely store artifacts creating during the build, as well as your third party and custom libraries. This is much more effective than using a version control system. This ensures that the libraries you are using are always at their latest versions and shared across your team. Securely storing artifacts can be done with solutions like Jenkins, Nexus, Artifactory, and more. Testing is a key part of your DevSecOps stack, allowing you to automate your unit, functional, regression, integration tests, and more. Solutions such as Cucumber, JUnit, and Selenium enable you to run your tests automatically prior to deployment. Of course, DevSecOps wouldn't be what its name says without secure. This is where your code will be scanned for vulnerabilities, and your containers for open ports and other vulnerabilities. Security solutions include SonarCube, Fortify, Contra Security, Qualys, Nessus, OWASP, Zap, and more. On to the next capability, deploy and operate. The ability to manage configuration requirements and push your builds into deployment is critical, not to mention managing your operations. Multiple solutions are available, such as Puppet, Chef, Ansible, and more. Now that your application is continuously deployed, you need to monitor it. Our sixth technology capability can be performed by solutions like Nagios, Neuralink, Nessus, the Elk Stack, Elasticsearch, Logstash, and Kibana, and Splunk. Of course, once you continuously monitor your applications, you may need to scale and leverage the benefit of the cloud elasticity thanks to cloud providers 
like AWS, Azure, Google, VMware, and many others. Now, this completes your DevSecOps loop and technology stack. Building a DevSecOps stack that enables you to continuously integrate and deliver your software isn't a small task, but it will be worth it if you leverage the right development principles. Microservices and containers such as Docker come to mind. Containerization technology helps you deploy your software on any cloud with ease. And container management solutions such as Docker Swarm or Kubernetes allows you to orchestrate and manage those containers at scale. That was a lot of information and tons of solutions. Are you feeling unsure about selecting the right solutions and building your own DevSecOps stack? Don't hesitate to reach out. We can help. Thank you again for watching. Please comment, like it, and share this video.